Okay, so today we're looking at a JTX Fitness Cyclo 5 and um, it's actually got an issue with the, I think it's a resistor motor and um, what happens is when you turn it on it will seem to be fine uh, but when you actually go and try and pedal there seems to be um, the same resistance throughout so you're pedaling and it's really quite difficult to pedal. Now the computer seems to be working, so you can set the mode, uh, a bit new to me this, so, and it's on the lowest level, but it's actually quite difficult to um, to pedal. So I'm going to have a go at taking this cover off, and then, well, take the pedal off first, I should imagine, uh, and then see what I can find underneath. I've heard from the help desk, which, who are very helpful, that it could be the resistor motor, which kind of puts the resistance into the pedaling. So it's kind of like a, I guess like a stepper motor and it just tightens the cable, I think, to the flywheel. So we'll have a go at that and then uh, we'll see what we find. Okay, so to remove the, um, the pedal from the, uh, the bike, we're gonna have to use an Allen key. Um, just to go into the main spindle and um, I should imagine it's going to be pretty tight to do so I'll probably have to do that off camera and then um, hopefully the pedal should come off after I've done, done it so let's have a look okay so with a bit of um it wasn't much required to uh, undo this so I've undone it I'll just um, take this off Longer than I thought. Talk, to, talk amongst yourselves. There we go. Right. So hopefully this should then just pull off again. I might have to give it a bit of a wiggle. Hang on. So with the uh, pedal cover um, and cover removed, this is really the step mode just stepping around. As it rotates, you can see it kind of tensions the where the cable should be, but the cable has become. So you can see uh, the motor's working, and then so the cable goes in, oh, it all comes out, and that seems to be going up and down. If you pull this cable, it goes up and down, you see it moving inside. So maybe it is just the cable, where it seems to have broken on the motor end, just in here, just in there. Seems to have broken. Um, yeah, so, new motor required. Sorry, not new motor, new cable required. Not a new motor. We'll see. I'll order one and uh, fit it and see how it goes. This is going to the maximum setting now. Then going to the hardest setting, it should go, sorry, this should go anti-clockwise. That's it. So that should be loosening it up. Loosening the cable. So a new cable was fitted and it fixed the issue.